Here we are, ready to go on to the next stage of our shower and bathtub cleanup. What we're going to do next, now that we've got our splash guard installed on both sides, we've got our nice long shower head installed. It's time to give this whole shower a real cleanup. This whole project is about doing it a lot faster and simpler and easier. Okay, so normally you would use bathroom tile cleaners and things like that. Well, for me, I find that the odors are really, really strong. I've got some like this. I won't mention any brands. And I've got other ones like this. And I've, over the years, I've had lots of them. But the one that I've turned out to like was not in hardware shower area, but something I found in the automotive store. This is a biodegradable degreaser that was for car engines and one day I happened to try it in the shower and loved it. There wasn't any odor or anything else and the guys that I like, like Tim Taylor and Red Green, they'd be proud of me. You're supposed to dilute this with water but I'm not. I'm going to just use it straight to show you how fast it'll take our cup job and we'll be out of here in no time at all. Why don't I get started? I'm going to try and do this so that we don't have to stop but because it's not going to take very long at all. The only other thing we might need is I've got one of these sponges. It's got the scotch braid on it. It's got scotch braid on this side and it's got sponge on this side. And the other thing is I've got an old toothbrush. I always keep old toothbrushes in case there's something I want to get that's in pretty tight I can get in there. I do this job regularly so it's not as bad as some that I've seen because I'm allergic to mold and mildew so I definitely try to not have it around. Okay, so let's get started, shall we? All I'm going to do is spray this really thick all over. And this is biodegradable so when it goes down the drain, it won't harm anything. Well, actually, it does have a little bit of odor, but not enough that's, that bothers me. There we are. And I think I'll go up and, and go right into the, right up as high as I can. Look at that, it's just coming off. I can see it rolling off already. What didn't I do over here? Okay, may as well do the tub while I'm at it. Okay, that's all. Now, I'll just take this, and uh, even though I don't think I need it, just rub around a little bit on the taps. Guess I wasn't fast enough. Might as well do the tub at the same time. Okay, done. Now, what we're going to do now is let's turn this off. Now, is that easy or what? Now you see why a 72 inch hose is the best one to get? <laughs> now that's good enough for the kind of people who are... Oh, you didn't even see how... You couldn't even see how it was doing that. Can you see how I go right up to the top? With this? Yeah, I think you can see it now. There. It's totally plain. I'm sure that didn't take more than, uh, I don't know how long we've been here, maybe 10, 15 minutes, no more. And it's totally done. And this is so easy to do, it's not even funny. But we're still not done yet. I've got to put the shower curtain back up. That'll be the next job to do. So we'll get right on that.